The Environmental Impact of Canadian Immigration Key Argument The article challenges the common perception that high immigration rates contribute to environmental sustainability. It argues that the opposite may be true, especially for countries like Canada. Supporting Points Consumption Patterns Immigrants from regions with lower carbon footprints, such as Eastern Europe and the Global South, tend to adopt higher consumption lifestyles in Canada, leading to increased carbon emissions. Economic factors. Modern economies rely less on manual labor and more on technology, reducing the need for a larger workforce. This means that increased immigration may not have a significant positive impact on the economy. Debt-driven consumption. Many immigrants may need to rely on debt to maintain their new, higher consumption lifestyles, further contributing to environmental strain. Policy implications. Canada's immigration policy should be revised to incorporate sustainability considerations, such as promoting greener lifestyles and infrastructure. Conclusion. The article suggests that Canada's immigration policy may be accelerating climate change and that a shift towards more sustainable practices is necessary. Potential counter arguments. Economic benefits. Some may argue that immigration can contribute to economic growth, which can lead to investments in green technologies and infrastructure. Cultural diversity. Immigration can bring diverse perspectives and skills, which can benefit society in various ways, including environmental protection. Individual choices. The environmental impact of immigration may depend on individual choices and behaviors rather than solely on the country of origin. Overall, the article provides a thought-provoking analysis of the complex relationship between immigration and environmental sustainability. It highlights the need for further research and discussion on this important topic.